Welcome trainers, Patrick from Training123. In this video, we're going to talk about training here on Thursday, September 29th, 2022. End of the month is coming. And here we are training the NQ. In the bottom left-hand corner is the panel that shows how many contracts we're trading, our stop, goal, and loss. Days trades are made 977%. Winners in our profit and loss, 1,168. So basically what here is we started the auto trader here using our market timing. And we get a trend change here. And we're trading three contracts. And it gets short and a little chop. Hits our, I believe it hit our first profit target there. And then stopped out on the other two. And then the trend was down. And so our trend filter here keeps us out of this little long here. And then it's stair-stepping its way down. So it gets short again. We hit our first, second profit target. And then the last runner comes down with the trail stop. And locks it in pretty good. We catch uh, about 80% of that wave down. And then it, just like the trade before, it doesn't take the long because the trend is down. And this is an automatic short right here. This is, uh, you know, what you call um, patterns repeat. So here it happened here and it happens again. And down we go, and then we hit our goal. And that's the way the software works. Trade one contract or 10 or 20, no restrictions. Now, did I get lucky on this trade? No, been trading for 24 years. Software does all the work for you, makes all the decisions. It's programmed to recognize the trend setups and trend reversals, and the filter helps. And so we turn it on and off it goes. Now you're at more risk if you start it. You know, I get emails all the time. How come you didn't start trading at 930 when the market opened? You're a cherry picker. You're a cherry picker. Yeah, right. Only rookies trade the open. Even with automated software, I mean, there's just a lot of imbalances on, a lot of news moving the market at the open. So you have all day to trade. Why trade the first five minutes? So for all you cherry picker sayers, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And plus, and plus if you have automation software and you see the market's making a high, all you got to do is enable it. And then when the trend changes, you're, you're going to, you know, be on the right side of the trade. And as you see, that's what exactly happened. And here's our performance for the trade, $1,168. Total net profit. We had a small loss of $98 or $88. And all the other figures at the bottom. So overall, good trade. If that was your daily profit goal, you're in the money. Call it a day. Come back and trade again the next day. And then there's the emails that say, well, you know, your system made nine trades. That's a lot of commission. No, it's not. There it is right there. $36.72 commission. If you think that's a lot of commission, you're crazy. Well, I want a system that'll make one trade and make $1,200 a day so I don't have to pay a lot of commissions. You know, another email. Well, go spend six months, hire a programmer, spend thirty, forty thousand dollars $40,000 and do it yourself, okay? Because <laughs> this software's been out for 10 years. It works great, as you will see in the other trades that we did. You know, a lot of traders have no idea of how much time goes involved into making a system. I mean, it's very, 
very time consuming and you spend a lot of money doing it and um, you know it can be very frustrating too because you're like 98% of getting it all right and then there's that 2% that are wrong and then you plug at it for another month or so pay the programmer some more money so uh, our system's been out for 10 years and works well so let's get on to the next trade and like I'm gonna even say here even with an auto trader there's you know no system that is 100 percent guaranteed here we start the auto trader it's an uptrend the trend filter didn't like this so it didn't take it short decides to take this long gets stopped out and then it goes short and it gets stopped out again a double whack-a-mole I call it so we got whacked for five hundred and eighty four dollars should have had my loss lower but it is what it is and that's what happened and so now you gotta bounce back from a loss and so you analyze the chart and you say, well, what did I do wrong? It all has to do about do with timing. There's certain times when you trade during the day and there's certain times that you don't. And once you understand that, you'll have more winning trades than, you know, somebody that's trading the 930 open. So now we need a bounce back trade. And what we'll do is we'll raise the goal a tad and here's the trade that happened so we have an $800 goal still three contracts and pretty much same kind of pattern as last time although this time you know it took this short and then it took a long here that didn't go anywhere it took another short and then a long and we bounced back and the auto trader exited a little early and we got our stop back. So again, this is all about timing, when they know to trade and when when not to trade. And that's all explained in our market timing manual that it lays all this out. So now that this is a winning trade, am I going to just, you know, hey, go ahead and reset the strategy right away and, and just keep letting it run? Nope not going to do that I'm going to let it trade a couple waves up and down and see what you know what's it doing because uh, the market goes through patterns and so we enable it here just short of the power hour and same pattern repeats trend change goes down hits our profit goal gets some gains and we got our profit goal a little lower here and then it ramps up and hits our profit targets and we're pretty close to our goal of eight hundred dollars so this is a, a this is a screenshot and so what do you think is going to happen next what, what what which way is the trend going and here's the outcome of that trade it ramped up here, kind of did a double triple top, had a small pullback, our trend filter keeps us out, and up we go. Average trader would have shorted here, got stopped, shorted again, got stopped, and maybe by then they would have gave up, called it a day. And here the auto trader makes all the decisions for you, and our trend filter keeps us out of this little pullback, and up we go. So another winner, winner, chicken dinner. So we basically hit our profit goal on all those trades for the day. So we're done trading the NQ. We call it a day, and then we switch over to the ES. And the ES, same patterns repeat each and every day. Timing pattern started in a downtrend. Trend change here. Uh, the trend was up, and basically it didn't take this short although it would have made some money so you could have shut the trend filter off if you wish that's totally up to you and we had a very simple goal of six hundred dollars on three contracts it reverses goes up breaks out in the power hour and we hit our goal and our day is over trading just about 
an hour and 45 minutes a day with the auto trader so thanks for watching the video hope you enjoyed it be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel here for more trading tips and information and hit that like button and go to our website subscribe up to our newsletter and sign up and subscribe to our social media accounts on Facebook and Twitter where we post our trades each day and we'll see you in the next video